All right. So uh, for this problem, uh, we have a block on the horizontal plane, and we have a force on it. So this is F A. So actually, it, this is F A X, and the F A F A X is along the X, uh, the horizontal direction. Uh, the expression for F A X is uh, uh, nine X minus three X squared. Yes. Okay. So uh, you see that uh, the this force is actually a function of the displacement, and uh, so for part A, we want to show the relation between the work and the displacement. To find out the work, we need to utilize the definition. So F A X dot dx and uh, so it's simply equal to uh, 9 over 2 x squared minus x cubed okay so this is a this is the work expression and uh, the plot here actually shows this uh, uh, the just shows the plot of this uh, of this work so this is the work and this is x and uh, for part B uh, we want to find out at which position the work is maximized. So basically, it's just the d w d x equal to zero, right? Because we want to find out the maxima. So we find that d w over d x actually it is just f a x. So basically, we just need we just need to find the zero point of this uh, of this uh, of this function, and uh, we can actually see that x equal to zero or three. However, the zero solution is a trivial solution. It means just at the initial point. So this is this, this does, does not mean anything. So we just cross this out, and the x equal to x equal to three give us the the maximum value. We can also see that from this diagram. So this is x equal to three. And for part C, uh, we want to find the uh, the work at uh, the, uh, we want we want to find the maximum work. So we just need to plug x equal to three into the uh, work expression. So we can see that this is equal to 13.5 joules. And for part D, we want to know at which position the work is uh, equal to zero. So uh, we need we just we just need to find the the, the zero the zero point of this uh, of this function. And uh, we can just say that uh, work equal to zero and save that and and uh, obtain that x equal to zero or 4.5. So uh, similarly, x equal to zero is a trivial solution. It means just at the initial point. So it, it has no any physical meaning. So we just cross this out. Uh, so the 4.5 has a zero point. This is uh, this is also proved here. And for part D, uh, for part E, we want to know at which position the block is at rest. Because initially the initially the block has no any initial velocity. Uh, if we want to find a position, if we find if if we want to find the location where the block is at rest again, it means that the change of the kinetic energy e k delta e k is zero, and delta e k actually equal to the work done by the force f a x. So we can, we obtain this relation again w equal to zero. So that is the zero point of this function. So we just obtained the solution from the previous part. So x equal to 4.5. Okay. Yes, this is meters. Don't forget. Don't forget the units.